Georgetown, Guyana, CMC, defending champions Barbados put one hand on the women's T20 Blaze title when they defeated main rivals Jamaica in the penultimate round here Monday. In one of three matches at the Guyana National Stadium, Barbados posted 129 for four off their 20 overs and then restricted the Jamaicans to 104 for six, to take sole possession of the lead on 16 points. Both teams entered the contest unbeaten but Barbados used an unbeaten 74 from captain Haley Matthews to take command of the title race. The elegant right-hander struck nine fours in a 63-ball knock to underpin the innings, posting 50 for the first wicket with Kaisia Knight 14, 26 for the second wicket with Kaishona Knight 10, and 24 for the fourth with Charlene Tate 8. Matthews reached her half-century off 47 deliveries in the 15th over with an aerial back foot drive to the cover boundary off off-spinner Kareen Howell. In reply, Jamaica got 26 from Chetan Nation and 24 from Chanel Henry but Jamaica failed to find the momentum needed for the run chase. They lost both openers Natasha McLean, 8, and Rashada Williams, 0, cheaply to plunge to 17 for 2 in the 4th over 3 partnerships then raised Jamaica's hopes of a recovery. Nation struck four fours in a 28-ball knock as she added 34 for the third wicket with captain Stefani Taylor, 18, who then put on a further 21 for the fourth wicket with Henry. When Taylor perished after a 27-ball labor, Henry posted 29 for the fifth wicket with Jerona Walcott, 14, but the partnership was a slow one, and Jamaica were left with too much to do at the back end. Trinidad and Tobago, meanwhile, won their second game when they got the better of Windward Islands in a one-run thriller. Defending a paltry 89, TNT managed to ruin Windward's run chase with captain Anissa Muhammad playing a key role by taking four for 16 from four overs of off-spin. Zaida James struck 28 from 35 balls with three fours but lacked support as no other batsman passed 20. West Indies batsman Brittany Cooper had earlier struck 47 from 41 balls with five fours as TNT reached 88 for eight off their 20 overs. In the other game, Guyana crushed winless leewards by 75 runs after gathering 122 for four from their 20 overs, thanks to the West Indies pair of Shemaine Campbell, 36, and Shakibi Gajbabi, 32 not out. Left arm spinner Kasia Schultz then grabbed 3 for 14 to help route Leewards for 47 in the 15th over.